Hey guys, welcome back. Welcome back to Clownfish TV. This is Neon. I am here with Geeky Sparkles. Hello. An attractive woman. An attractive oh, woman see, nice. Who is going I to- I would argue with that, but thank you. She's going to give her opinion on uh, unattractive women- I'm just tired of video this. video games. I'm just tired of this. It's like, you know, we got to make women ugly so ugly women feel better about themselves. Uh, Japan is not having it. Japan has been making fun of Western video games for a couple of years now. It seems like every time there's a, a new triple A title with a female lead, the developers go out of their way to make the, the female lead as unattractive as possible because God forbid uh, men get any any creepy ideas. Right, but then they game. don't buy your game either. They don't buy their game. I'm just tired of it. I'm tired of the whole idea that, that you can only be a strong woman if you're unattractive. And I'm like, I think there's a lot of women come in different, you know, sizes, shapes, and appearances. And I'm tired of being told that strong women have to look like men. I'm tired of being told, you know, I'm just tired that if you're pretty or you, or you want to be pretty, that there's something wrong with you. Because um, frumpy journalists don't like it. That's why you get April O'Neil looking like dog shit in the movie. Oh, my God. Yeah. So we're going to talk about this because th this has come up uh, several times. I did a video not too long ago talking about uh, Tanya in, in uh, Mortal Kombat 1 that they... Uh, made her less conventionally attractive uh, than usual, than than she's normally been portrayed, and and people are like, what the hell is going on? Like, what? I mean, it's 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 become so obvious now that they're going out of their way. Yeah, this is it. To make women unattractive, and Japan thinks it's hilarious and stupid, and they're probably not going to buy the game. Well, that's just it. People aren't going to buy the games because they're going to be like, this is dumb. All right, so let's talk about this. We haven't talked about the Fable very much, but I know people were making fun of the, the lead in the trailer a couple of weeks ago. Before we get into it any further, please subscribe for more pop culture news, views, and rants, guys. If you do, you'll get a woohoo. Woohoo! I'm trying. You're trying. I still can fight. She's it just fighting. sounds terrible while I do it. Yeah, she's she's been under the weather the last couple of days, um, you know, but she's Can't still very attractive. down. She's still very attractive. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, she's my nose sick. is all red. I'm sure I look great. <laughs> so You're doing hard. better than she is, right? I feel bad because the actress that plays her is really cute. Yeah, she's she is. And I guess you know, the features about this this character is supposed to be based on her, but there's, I mean, I don't. Mm -mm. Yeah, something was lost in translation here. Yes. So, uh, according to Niche Gamer, according to Niche Gamer, Japanese netizens are repulsed by Fable Heroine's new look. Uh, the notoriously hated Fable remake trailer has seemingly just now reached the eyes and ears of Japanese individuals. <laughs> uh oh, yeah, Japan doesn't hold back. You know, anytime there's a controversy like this, they're like, "Why the hell? You Why know? are her hands so big? Is that her right there?" Yes. Okay, that's a man. I'm sorry, that's, that's a, a man. man. Look at the hands. Okay, I have big hands. I, for a girl, I do. I have hands are really big, and um, her her hand. The, your hands that, are that, wonderful. That is a dude. You take that and put it. You put a, a dude dude's outfit and ch can put short hair on it. That is a man. Why is it the women are supposed to be portrayed as basically men? If I saw this, I would think this is like a teenage boy eating a sandwich. Right. Has, Look at the size longer. of the hands. I mean, again, your hands about the size of your face, but come on. No, no, they're not petite. She has to be able to grab that sword, right? Hey, there's a lot that of girls hilt. who can use swords, and their hands don't look like that. Uh, Japanese users that's have like shared. An she does. maybe she's maybe that's that that's a plot point. She's half ogre. Japanese users have shared similar sentiments from the previous trailer regarding its atrociously bad and out of place character design, serving as another example of the video game industry being obviously out of touch with fans and intent on destroying the medium with a biased political agenda. You know, here's the thing too. The assumption nice. is they're doing it because they want to stick it to men, right? Yeah. What about women who like women? What about women who just like to play characters that are pretty? Because I like the I like games and I like characters that are pretty. I, I don't I mean I don't like women that way, but I can appreciate a character that's very pretty. And I mean and since we're little on, they've done tests on this and stuff, psychology people just drawn to people that are more attractive. It's just the way it is. I mean You're not allowed to say that. That makes it's the truth feel though. Bad. And this is coming from somebody who's who's not, you know, I wouldn't say I'm up there. Okay, I'm not a 10 by any means. You are a nine and three quarters. You're just being biased. The truth of the matter is I am not a super attractive woman, which I've, I've stressed repeatedly because I want people to get their hopes up for something that's not true. But I don't I'm not offended if I see a character that's a girl that's pretty. It doesn't offend me in any way. Like they keep making out like we have to do it because it's offensive to women. It's like I'm a woman. I'm not offended. Well, well, the Japanese are offended. Well, they can be. I don't blame them. The Japanese are offended. 
She looks horrible. I mean, yeah, it's an insult to the poor actress. Yeah, I know. That's well. That, she's cute. That happened with uh, the Last of Us Part Two too. The the one character, um, the actress was actually pretty attractive, and then they just made her pretty and fugly. Yeah, and it's kind of like know. basically well, they're basically implying that the that the, the the average woman's ugly as hell. Yes, uh, we have to make video game women. That's uh, a man, attractive. baby. That's a man, baby. Japanese consumers have uh, co- gotten wind, gotten wind. Because they were breaking wind. She's breaking wind. Gotten wind she of the tra- gotten wind of the trailer, and their comments were in agreement with most, as they despise the character design. So this is uh, actually coming from a Japanese site, uh, Asutura, Asuturu, and I'm gonna I'm gonna trust their translation because uh, you know I, I can't read Japanese. This is what they supposedly said. Foreigners consider this to be a beautiful woman, therefore it's amazing. <laughs> If Link had this kind of face, I'd immediately throw my switch out the window like a frisbee. I can only see the face of a bastard. <laughs> that sounds like a that sounds like a light novel. It does. I can only see the face of a bastard. That's a, that's a webcomic right there. I can only see the face of a bastard. Oh my god, she's so ugly. She's exiled from her her home. There you go. And, uh, she has to fight. Slimes. Big Dad took a look at her. Nope, not the father, and walked away. I can only see the face of a bastard. Yes, I am a very pretty, attractive man, and and you are not my daughter. Get the hell out of here and take this damn sandwich with you. Feels like a face that was beaten over and over again uh, with a political correctness stick. <laughs> oh my god! Sorry if I wheeze. I'm really sick, but this is funny. The true form of the feminist is that of a Chinese spy. If taken seriously, sales will plummet. So don't consume China's lewd games and monopolize the share. What? Something was lost in translation, like her face. Seems to be some game cockroaches worship. Androgynous like ugly. Looks like the face of one of the background giants. in uh, It looks like an ogre. Yeah, it does. It does. Isn't that a man? Yes, thank you. What? Is this the heroine? It gives me hope that even an ugly guy can become the hero. <laughs> no, no, because you're a dude. You don't become the hero no matter what. Oh, no, this one's this one's No, we're bad. not. That's we're not, not gonna, okay. I'm going to – you can read that one for yourself because I don't want YouTube to get mad. I didn't say it. <laughs> this next one's funny. Moi and Kawaii are Japan's greatest weapons wield them. <laughs> yes. Uh, the series is already done for, ordered to throw the main character's charm down the drain. Uh, Pori Kori, is that what they, is that the template? Yeah, so yeah, basically again, political that's correctness. They're, they're saying the political, political correctness, correctness stick again. It's like an alien taking the form of an earthling. Alloy still looks better because she looks like a beautiful woman from some angles. Um, yeah, that was actually the, the main character from uh, Horizon. And there was a lot of controversy that she didn't look very good. But then when you actually saw the game, like Squid King was playing it, she actually looked okay, you know, for the most part in the game. But this this woman does not look good for many. Now, this angles. last comment is actually... A pretty good idea for a game because you know what? People play the hell out of it. If a character got hotter and, let, and, and had less clothes the longer you played. This is a level one face, right? It should gradually become more beautiful as the level rises. That's actually not a bad idea for That's a game. That's a good idea for a manga. That's a good idea for an anime. The more you buy, the prettier she gets. She starts out really ugly. Well, wasn't wasn't that um, Yennefer and Witcher? They, yeah, they did that. Yeah. <laughs> she basically, the, she went up a couple of levels and, the and then she got hot. Like, the one person was basically like, you know, we hired her because, you know, she was more believable about not being pretty. I'm like, the girl plays her is really pretty. I was like, what are you talking about? Oh but yeah, God. okay. Yes, but that's actually, that's a marketing, that's a brilliant strategy right there. So, that, would, that would sell like crazy. So she gets hotter. The, the, the more the longer level. you play. So the it's like the you, shield hero. The more DLC you buy, the hotter she gets, the less clothes she wears. You'd make a mint. It's like, yeah, the shield hero is rising. The more level she goes up, mm-hmm. you know, um, she makes the other heroes rise. Yeah. That, oh, God, that would be there probably is. There probably is an anime like that. That's smart. Where That's she starts out. Marketing, baby. She starts out as a, a triple A Western frumpy, ugly man looking thing. And then by the end of it, when she hits like level 20. She starts out as the new spy, the, the, the new Ninja Turtle. I'm sorry. The new Ninja Turtle, April O'Neil. And yes. by the end, she ends up being like. Hot yeah. April from from the comics. Or there whatever, you go. The original comics. Yeah. Very, well, she questionably hot. But you know what I'm saying. Like, that'd be awesome. Then by the end, she's like wearing a thong and she's like dual wielding and she's like, you know. Now look. Super I mean, hot. I'm just because they're like we're trying to appeal to women. It's like, but what makes you think women don't want to play pretty characters? I mean, 
that's what gets me. It's like they keep assuming that to make a character strong female and to be, yeah, this about political correctness, you have to be ugly. Because ugly women are people too. Ugly women are people too. I'm speaking for some. And I'm just saying that. But you you're know, not one of those women. That think the ugly women people too. I think. No, that, you're you're not one of those ugly women. You know. Well, but an yeah, attractive saying, goddess who uh -huh, I can't keep yeah, my hands yeah, yeah. It's because you're married to me, and people question your decisions. But um, look, I'm just saying, there's the idea that you know that you only want to see people look like you is not true. <laughs> Sometimes you do, but a lot of times you just you know ugly girls can appreciate pretty girls too. Players want to see themselves represented in the media they consume and since most of the players are going to be men they made her look like a dude there you go finally i that's, can see myself i can go. see myself because honestly in this take game. That, that ponytail off that's a man she doesn't even have tits that they're kind of there that's a, you put a, a put a, 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 a male armor on her and, and hide the ponytail that's a dude that's a dude that's a dude yeah uh dude doesn't even look like a lady it's just it's just a dude they even put like they even tried to make her face screwed up with her teeth and the thing on her side, you know, just to make it look even worse. Just to make her look derpy. She looks like freaking uh, Gomer Pyle. You know how he used to do the thing with his jaw to get. God. Okay. So there you go. Japan hates it too. This game's gonna do so well overseas. Uh, that's yeah, why it's they gonna hate do so ourselves. well in general. Just to say it's gonna do so well. It's gonna do there. so well. It's gonna do so well. We're gonna wrap this up. Yes. Please subscribe for more pop culture news, views, and rants, guys. We'll talk later. Bye. Help support the channel. Go to thereef.support and get early access to podcasts, videos, and other content. That's thereef.support.